Okay, uh, this is going to be a follow-up to Kevin's video. It's more or less going to be my side of things and what I think about the battle pass. Not the battle pass, but the backstage pass and the uh, new roadmap. Uh, for starters, that roadmap is nothing. That roadmap doesn't offer anything besides telling the people, hey, we're going to bring in support fighters like Minette. Okay, that's kind of cool, right? But... What about the other fighters? What about what about the exclusives that you guys have released over the past year? Red Rider, Sonic, Final Fang, Alter Ego. Damn, like, come on, do something. <laughs> I mean, look at Guilds. Guilds has been teased around for years. I was... I think I came around the... When I first started playing in this game, it was... December of 22 and I still saw the and I still saw the coming soon for the guild info so guilds have been for me teased for two years other people far longer than that I'm guessing three four maybe five years at this point and I think people are gonna get fed up at some point you cannot be releasing backstage pass after backstage pass thinking oh that will solve your uh player activity no it doesn't not even in the slightest like why sure i don't mind these uh backstage pass fighters i could pay for them but like for the people who do free to play and they have to wait for a whole year straight and for example look at my collection i've been saving all of these just so i could get a single exclusive and <laughs> and they haven't even dropped them yet <laughs> what the fuck and don't get me started on fucking ribs, dog. Like, no. Hold on. We already have, um... Remember how Don't Poke the Viewer used to be, like, the main head headache? Now it's fucking, uh... What was it called again? Is it Corrosive Element? I think I have it around here. Ah, here it is. This is bugged. Why is the... <laughs> Why the fuck have you not focused on your Rift meta rebalancing that? Whenever you guys say, oh, we're going to rebalance something, it just feels like you're going to make it 10 times worse. Look, I'm kind of glad that uh, Futile Resistance got a buff. That's okay. I don't mind that since Band is absolute dog shit and he hasn't gotten a buff in years. His kit is trash. Look at my boy. Look, like, come on. He has so much potential. He used to be dominating old Rift. Well, that was because back then we didn't have piercing stats and accuracy. I could get I could understand why he fell off pretty harshly. But please focus on this damn game. What the fuck? And I feel like Rift is also way too fucking competitive, if you think about it. Like just top three. Other gacha games have like top twenty at most. They're really generous, and no offense, you are... HBS, you are really stingy with your reward system. <laughs> like, what the fuck? I could go on, right? I could go on for days right now. For example, you guys were like, okay. I feel like Holodeck Mayhem was alright. But at the same time, it could also use some tweaking. Like, I personally don't like the uh, four ticket system. I don't know, that's just me though. Some people like it, some people hate it, but I personally don't like it because you don't get a lot of resources from this and you are timed on resources, which is kind of annoying when other games you could just fucking farm for ages without a care in the world. Oh, and Versus? Don't worry about Versus, that shit is so dead. <laughs> Nobody's playing that. No one. Okay. Back to the roadmap since I've been uh, I've been yapping about other shit, but I want to talk back talk back to the roadmap. They were mentioning something related with uh, the usage of uh, avatars and other uh, customizable uh, icons. I guess is that what you call it? Okay. Anyway, they were apparently teasing the fact that they're gonna add what's it called. Um, what was it called? I keep forgetting. My old ass can't keep up with this game. It was called... What the fuck was it called? Man, okay, point being is you get a stat bonus 
I'm really concerned about that because that makes it feel even more pay to win. And I personally don't like it. Not many people like it. We don't know for sure if it's going to affect riffs and price fights or if it's just going to affect price fights only. Or is it going to affect all game modes? We don't even know if it's a flat stat attack boost or like a flat stat boost or like a percentage boost. That is really concerning as well. Anyway, Minette is cool. I could give you guys that, but I feel like you distracted everybody with that new character, with that new support character, and you guys didn't touch upon the other aspects of your game. Of your game, God, boy, crack, my bad. <laughs> I feel like you guys haven't touched upon the other aspects of your game, like exclusive fighters, big band not getting a buff, guilds, price fights. Just watching is basically watching paint dry. I'm not kidding. I feel like this game is becoming more repetitive to the point like many people are starting to quit. And a lot of people have started to quit. I could like name a few people like personal friends of mine already quit. Like what the fuck? Sure it sucks but like at the same time I could understand their fucking annoyance. Because you guys keep uh, tossing everything under the rug. Like why would you guys do that? You, I may sound better. I'm just disappointed overall. Sure, you're maybe sure I may be sounding hypocritical and saying, yo, yo, you you fucking wailed, you nerd. Yeah, I wailed because I wanted to support this game. <laughs> I had a hope that these people would have uh, changed the uh, a few aspects of the game with my wailing. You could just say I could stop, like, yeah, I could stop, but at the same time I'm not gonna stop supporting them. I still have hope that they could change a few things here and there. Sure, I'm gonna shit talk them because they rightfully so deserve it. <laughs> At the end of the day, um, don't go on harassing these uh, these devs. I could understand why uh, some people are hyped, some people are really upset. But at the same time, I the reason why I keep playing personally is because of the people. The people I made connections with. Really cool people. Honestly, I don't know if if I would be making this video, hell, I, I wouldn't even know if I ever make it this far into this game without talking with other people. Anyway, let's see what you gave me. Trash. Okay, uh... I think I've been talking here for too long, it's been like 7 minutes. And I hope that fucking recording isn't scuffed. Because if it is, I'm gonna have to do a lot of editing. Fuck. <laughs> anyway. I think that's about it. Alright, later.